Hello, my name is Johnny Chaffin from Collins Manufacturing, and today we're going to talk about how to clean and service the 1701 hair trap. The hair trap is located in place of the P-trap. It uses slip joints to hold the trap in place. These joints are very susceptible to movement. So one of the things that's important to remember is this cap does not need to be over tightened. It makes it difficult to install and difficult to remove. The second thing is, is when you're removing it, you should always hold the body of the trap to prevent torquing these joints. So you hold it with your left hand, loosen it, pull the trap out, empty it into a trash can, reinstall it, making sure that this V notch matches the notch in the bottom of the body of the trap, and reinstall it. And again, holding what we call backup on it as you tighten it up. Another thing to remember is your trap, when you remove it, if you've been using the sink, will be full of water. So you'll need to place a pan underneath to catch that water. And after you get through installing the cap, it's just firmly in place. Run water in the sink and double check for leaks underneath here. If you have no leaks, then you're good until the next time you need to service the unit. Thank you.